Hello everyone, my name is Adam. Welcome back. Today we're on we were back on Days Gone. Last time we had found Lenny's secret stash and we had delivered it to Ada Tucker and we were at discount on some firearms. Need anything? What's that? Uh if I can remember correctly. What are you looking for? We have to do another thing up for another thing. And I can't remember what that other thing is. So, I guess we'll go ahead and try to figure it out real quick. Alright, I see how it is. Later. What do you want? How's it going? Hey, what's up? Let me get the gate for you. Deke, you there? Boozer, why the hell aren't you in your damn bunk? Couldn't sleep. You remember what I said back in the tunnel? Don't go up there, Dave. It's it's making you crazy. Boozer, I okay, look. I go up there because there's freaks out there. Here I kill them. Bounties are all the same. Rest. I gotta go. Deacon out. And I'm too loose, Bowser. There's still crap getting right. Ha. You got offended that the flowers weren't uh, correctly depicted. Or you didn't get them correct of what kind they were. Where am I, anyways? Uh. Where's my arrow? There it is. Okay, okay, now I see what we gotta do. Um. Hmm. I guess we ought to go up here. And see what's... Around. So we're gonna go ahead and make our way back over there. I'll head your way, St. John out. Okay, so now after I leave, Tucker to Deacon St. John. She has a job. I talked to Alki the other day. Some of the other men. Still here. I know you've been doing runs for the camp. This isn't gonna take before I just wanted to say thank you. Nice refugee camp. Yeah, you all would have been better off out in the ship. Nero couldn't protect you from a goddamn thing. Oh. Okay. <laughs> All right. Where? You're mine now. Hmm. <laughs> 
key. Let's take a look around. I lost the tracks for a second. There you are. Deacon St. John, this is Tucker. Like I said before, I haven't seen Boozer Sweet Face around these last few days. You sure he's alright? This is Deacon. Boozer's fine. Like I said, he's just been busy. Doing runs for that son of a bitch Mark Copeland, no doubt. I get the feeling he doesn't like me much. Loser, I mean. Like um, I said, I ain't his old lady peeking out. Oh, Jesus, something He just down. has an injured arm up there. Bastards had anything worth looking for. Could make something out of this. Yeah. So there's a sawed off shotgun and then a, an AK 47. Some ammunition as well. I wonder if I can swim. All right, so I found nothing there. So I guess we're gonna go ahead and head back to Tucker, do that job that she needs us to do, and then head to the next spot. So let me go ahead and set a waypoint back to here. Is it? God damn, this has got to be close. I don't know why I threw a mol uh, pipe bomb. I was trying to throw a Molotov. Seriously. 
Alright, so the next one I think I'm gonna use on on a uh, on stamina whenever I get another upgrade. Are you serious? I need more supplies. So we're gonna go ahead and I'll be right back. We'll be right back when we're we're at the uh, the Bake Springs camp, I think that's what it's called, or Hot Springs. So yeah, I'll be right back. So uh, I found this spot on the way. I wanted to go ahead and show ex the ex exploration of it. Uh, you know. So why not? So, yeah. That's kind of interesting.
<laughs> Alright, well, that's all I can find, I guess. So I guess we'll go and be back when we're at the uh, hot springs. Deke, you ever ride with a drifter, scars all over his face, carries a tire iron, goes by the name of Limbo? Don't know him. He came into camp yesterday to turn in some bounties, have a few drinks. Seems like he didn't leave until early this morning. Well, Tuck, I don't run security here, so why don't you just tell Alki about that? He beat a man, Deke, and a woman, to death, Bowman and Hewitt. Her face was so smashed in, you couldn't tell it was her. Hewitt... Maria, right? Oh, Jesus. This asshole, Limbo, he's a local. Alki says they've set up shop at the old Forest Service watchtower on the east slope of Three Finger Jack. Yep, I know where it is, and, uh, I'll handle it. I thought you might. All right, so I guess we're gonna look for a guy who beat a guy, How's it going? and also beat a girl. Get the lead out. So. Get back to work. Just a sec. Gotta open the gate. Thanks, guy. So I guess we're gonna go take care of him and whoever else, and then claim, claim a bounty for him. And then after that, we'll proceed to where the next mission mission is at. So. Interesting. So yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Huh. Hey Tuck, I'm here. Run yeah. all you want. Limbo and his crew were calling the place home. He said his face was scarred, so uh more please what else be telling me. He wears a green coat. Looks like a goddamn leprechaun. Okay, so uh, I didn't think that through. So we're gonna go ahead and kill everyone and then be right back. Alright, now let's go and take care of everyone else. Shotgun style. When you have a knife, just stab. Just conserve ammunition. You don't need to waste it on low-life scum. Scrap. Still got old iron tooth on you, yeah? Okay. Mine now. Come 
last. All right, let's do this. All right, we're gonna we're gonna do this. What was it? How did they do it in uh? I can't remember the movie, but I'm, it's they went, they went in shotgun style, like guns blazing. Oh, we're gonna go and kill everyone. Oh my gosh. Come on. We're gonna grab this AK. Uh, or not. Come on. There we go. That's what I need for right now. We're gonna. Punisher style. Although he used an, he used an F16. I know. There we go. Not, not hard, not hard at all. Heal up. And then we're going with our stamina. I'm gonna grab this shotgun. Grab that med kit. Let's see if there's anything else I can grab while I'm here. Can I take this motorcycle? I want this one. Why would I want to sabotage the motorcycle that's better than my own? Why can't I just take it? Die. Come on. There we go. More bounties. How come I can't grab his sniper rifle? Oh, is it just the same one? Okay. That's fine then. I was thinking it was better, but I guess not. Honestly, I don't know why I can't just take one of these. These seem to be a lot better. Eh, but oh well. Like, yeah, these bikes seem to be a lot better. Oh, well, obviously they're smoking, but. Eh. Is that the reason why you can't take them? Is, or is that why they have them smoking so you can't take them? That's lame. Go ahead and head back to uh, Tucker. So I'll be right back. All right. So it seems to be that we have people who are trying to uh, invade, pretty much. So we're gonna go and 
kill him. There's him. He's dead. Got him as well. Alright. These guys are lame. I'm not gonna lie. I threw a grenade on my bike too, I think, so I gotta repair it. Hey, let me in. Right, open it up. He's okay. Oh no, never mind, I'm good. First, let me go ahead and search whatever this person has. Weirdos, I swear. Oh, how's it going? Terrible. That I do. I'll go to you in a bit. You here for your bike? Yes. I need to fill her up. Oh, oh you're out of gas. We're gonna run out of this someday, you know. See ya. Bye. What do you want? You find that son of a bitch? Yeah, yeah. here's old like Iron you. Tooth, just like you asked. Ah, uh, nice. Deke, you're always the one person I could count on to get things done. <laughs> you know, I have no idea where you and Boozer rode off to, but it's good to see you. Well, we're around, Tuck, and if you need anything, you know how to reach me. Go see Alki. I'll update your credits. Nice. Okay. What? All right, so I need ammo again. Can I get anything <laughs> else for you? Yes. You anything else? Yes. What else can I do for you? <laughs> you sound annoying. I'm not gonna lie. Come by if you still need something. Yeah. See you around. First. Can I help you? Let's go ahead and turn in these bounties. You here for your bike? Yes. Hey, just taking a look. I can fix this. Should work. Last time I saw Boozer was a few weeks ago. He's still around. He, uh, same as ever. Guess he's just been busy. Heard a rumor that he got hurt or something. That's just Tucker making shit up. He's fine. Okay. Mm-hmm. See you again. This episode is going to be a little bit longer than usual. I usually end them around 30 minutes. Uh, we're going to go ahead and make this one just a little bit longer, not too much longer. Maybe 40, 45 minutes. So. Yeah. I think I'll know what I'm gonna do. We have a little bit of time. Oh god. 
I did not think this through. I'm scared. I did not think that through. <laughs> I should get a full, uh, full auto. So, yeah, wonderful. How do, I get, how do I get past there to continue forward? Be useful. I'm trying to figure out how to progress forward. I'll be back when I figure out how to get over to the other side. Alright, so I figured out how to get through. I just had to go around more. So, I also got a, su I got a su suppressor on my pistol. So, let's see if we can get headshots here. There's one. Not here. How many? 
All right, I got four more to go. Let me go ahead and heal up real quick. I thought that was a swarm. I guess not. That's the last of them. All right, let's go ahead and search that chopper. That, sh that Sarah was in. Because apparently he might, she might not be dead. Hey, babe. Yeah. I, I cleaned them out. They won't be bothering you no more. Oh, uh, hey. Me again. Is he going to tell you something? Hey, it's okay. It's just my you told me that we shouldn't come back, and I didn't listen to you. I mean, I knew that it was getting worse, but I... None of us knew it was going to be a way for this. You don't understand. I don't know what I would do if I lost you. This is my fault. Hey. I'm not losing anyone. I made a promise. Remember? Deacon, wait! Sarah, come on. There's a kid here. <laughs> hey. Oh, hey, are you okay? <laughs> come on, we gotta find your parents, okay? Really? Hey. Was that zombie? Was that kid a zombie, or just a regular kid that was just a piece of shit? Just hold this here as long as you can. I don't think so. I think I can walk. Good enough. Almost there. I would just lift her up, I'm not gonna lie. Especially because she looks to be around 120, 130. Not that heavy at all. Yeah, she's burning out. The uh, knife must have nicked her kidney or something. She's turning septic. Mm. How you doing, little sister? So stupid. It was this little, this little kid. This, this goddamn little kid. Big goddamn knife. Hey, help me. Mm. Mm. Oh, shit. Mom, you want to be able to come through? We gotta get to the roof. Flag down one of those choppers. Right. Yeah, see if you can rest over here. Hey, mm? easy, easy. <sighs> she reminded me so much of my little sister, you know. Mm. Yes, yeah, so that hide and seek game all the time. She would just, just uh, hide her head in her coat just like that. Um, I've been good my name. If it was me personally, I wouldn't let that slide. Jesus. Look at him. We gotta move him. We're going that way. Uh, come on. Alright, hey sweetheart, can you move? Yeah, I got her. Go find us way out.
got this. Go. Hey, 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 I'm unarmed. I'm unarmed. Get out. Now listen to me, listen to me. My girl's out there, she's been stabbed. We're just trying to get to the roof. Get out there's here. a helicopter you waiting. Her. So listen. You killed just... my wife! Oh, no, no, no. Look, I, I didn't know anything about your wife being killed. I'm sorry, sir. No, sir. I didn't do anything. No, you didn't do anything. You killed my wife! 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 We need help. She's Interesting. Been well, what's wrong with her? Well, she's not. Whatever the hell's going on out there, she's been stabbed. I can't take anymore. Oh, okay, listen, O'Brien. If we don't get her to a hospital, she's going to die. There are no more hospitals. Oh, come on, no more hospitals. You got uh, doctors, you got triage, you got a mass unit. Oh, look, I'm just a grad student, okay? I, I got volunteered for this. I'm not even supposed to be out here, okay? Brian. Okay. Uh, I've only got room for two of you, okay? Two. What do you got room for two of you? We're over weight, okay? I can only take two of you, two. <laughs> Overweight my ass. Come on, help me, come on. All right, sweetheart. It's okay. You're gonna be all right. I got her. Okay, Boozer, let's go. We gotta get on that. We gotta get on that. I heard what he said. There's only room for two on that chopper. Go. Go with her. I'll be okay. Look, I've been through worse shit than this before. You know? Here we go. Where are you going? What? Where? Where? Refugee camp, west of Three Finger Jack. No. Boozer is never going to make it without me. I want this back. You coming? Rest easy, okay? I'll, uh, I'll be back to check on you, and uh, I know, yeah, you wouldn't want me to, but I guess Boozer's right. I can't, I can't help myself. It's, uh, it's like I said, I'll be back. Huh. So it just pretty much showed how she got stabbed, but that was about it. I didn't show anything else. I thought we were supposed to check to see if she had that Boozer, on the chopper. Another Nero chopper. I wonder what the hell they're up to. Let's go and search this area first. Deke, you there? Huh, had some time on my hands? Made you some shit. Boozer, thank you. Yeah, I'll stop by when I can. Deacon out.
I need to find that gas canister that was just over here. There it is. And then I'm gonna go ahead and head back to Boozer. Oh, first I'm gonna go ahead and grab this uh, bounty. Refugee camps, they did turn out to be death camps, just not the way you were expecting. You're crossing the road. Two years ago, you would have gone splat. Okay, that's not fair. Reload faster, please, 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 please. Ooh. Run. Yeah, I know I'm going too far. I got taken off my bike by a freaking zombie wolf. You went up there again, didn't you? After I told you not to. Look, I just leave it. All right, I'm just out hunting for each boozer. You got that? I'm trying this again. Only reason that I go up. Shit, brothers, damn it. Slowing down. Looks like they're stopping. Did bro just get shot? I saw some blood. I could have sworn he just got shot. I guess not. I mean, if they were trying to hit me, I would be dead. Deke, remember me telling you about that death wish of yours? Yeah, 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 I got this. Deke it out.
tank isn't working. No, it's working. Well, this little shit could have torn your head off by now. Come on, Doc, stay it up. Calm the hell down. Hey, Tommy. Give me a minute. That's cool. A whole swarm. Oh Jesus! Is that a horde? Coming horde, yeah. Well, great. Now we gotta wait for them to, to run to run off so we can get this thing. Almost out. So the pipe bomb actually works. I don't know why I keep switching to the Molotov when I'm trying to grab the pipe bomb though. That's irritating. But, uh, all right, let's go ahead and see what they left. Yeah, okay, there's a radio. Jeez. God damn it, get back here with that! Oh shit, that's mine! Ah, <laughs> oh, finally! Jesus Christ, those shits can run fast. <laughs> I enjoy so it, don't ask why. What are they doing? Looked like they were out here. Shit, wrangling freaks, I don't know. They had a newt in some kind of noose, like they were putting a tracking device on it or something. What? Wrangling? What do you mean? You know, like tying it up, taking samples from it or something, like those guys used to do on that wildlife show. Pretty fucked up. They got chased off by swarmers, bugged the hell out. They left some gear behind, a radio. Wait, you don't, you don't think that Sarah... No, no, no I, I, I don't know. I'm just... Yes. He's alive, Boozer, he's alive. O'Brien, one of them, Nero. I'm gonna track him down. If I can, I, I'm gonna... I'm gonna get some answers. Damn it. Okay. Look, I'll be able to ride soon. I'll help you, Deke. If he's alive, we'll find the bastard. <sighs> You're goddamn right. I'm gonna check in later. Deacon out. Okay, O'Brien. Where the hell are you? So I'm sort of lost. I was hoping you could help me out. I'm sorry, you're lost? Yeah, yeah, I'm looking for the old Belknap Road and there's not a lot of signs around here. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me. Nope. What? What is it? What? Oh, it's <laughs> great. That is just perfect. What is it, a Chevy? That is great. That is great. So about those directions? <laughs> I'm really sorry. I, I don't know where Belknap, Belknap, Belknee, Bel Belknap. Belknap, that's the one. And I don't know where it is. I really can't help you. I'm sorry. So no, then? <sighs> nope. Okay. Well, thanks anyway. 
Use a ride. Yes, I could. Thank you for finally offering. I'm Sarah. I'm Deacon. Oh, well, sorry about the mess. <clears throat> um, I don't. How do I? Uh, this contraption. Pretty much what you think. You just throw your just... leg over. Yeah. Okay. Um. There. Whoa. Okay. <clears throat> Ready. Hey! <laughs> hey! Hold on tight. Thank you so much. No problem. It's just, there are no bars out here, so... Well, sure there is. There's a place called Crazy Willie's up the road. There's, uh... No, I meant cell phone reception. I know what you meant. Right, of course. Anyway. So what's a nice girl like you doing in a place like this? <laughs> you know, I ask myself that all the time. I do research. Um, you know, I study things. Thanks. Had no idea what research was. Sorry. Um, I do plants. You study plants? Yeah. You sure you're okay? Yeah, I'm fine. I just... Oh, my God. Hey. Hey. I've got cell phone reception. Hey. Yeah, I'm fine. I just... The car you gave me, it's a real piece of shit. I need a tow. I'm on, um... I don't know, some... I don't know where Road I am. Road 42. Road 42? Yeah, I'm, I'm about a mile up. Okay, I'll see you when you get here. Come on, I'll take you back to your car. We can wait for the tow truck. Uh, <laughs> I don't know. Well, all right. I'm sure when those boys come back, they'd be happy to give you a ride, so... <laughs> okay, all right. <clears throat> all right, I just... It'll be any minute now. All right, so. all right, all right, screw it, let's go. Just drive a little careful this time, okay? <laughs> <sighs> wow. You weren't really lost, were you? Well, that all depends on who you ask. My ex would say I've been lost for years. Well, you certainly know your way around here. So you're not from around here. No, I'm from Seattle. The company that I work for, they Ew. just, they opened this lab Seattle. here, so... Here I came to the middle of nowhere. To research plants. That's right, I already told you I forgot. Um, yeah, so the company that I work for, they, they do work for this bioengineering firm, and um, some of the plants that I, I look at are pretty rare, and they just happen to grow here. That has got to be the best thing I've ever heard. It's a pretty cool bike. Clay, we got company. Oh, shit. All right, gentlemen. Huh? Was I not just huh? kicking their asses? Yes, hit him again. I like how she's just watching.
Hell yeah. <laughs> Oh my god. Hey, keep your, your trigger gonna... keep your finger off the trigger. Oh my god. Hey. I'm so sorry. No, I, no, no. I don't even know. I just was looking in your bag and no, it's I, I right. saw that and I no. Oh my god, I could have killed somebody. Well Oh shit. Yeah, but you, you gotta kinda aim it at them first. I've never done anything like that. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay. I They're saw gone. it in They're your gone. bag and I just I tried to call you the police, good. but there were no You know what we're gonna no do? Bars. We're gonna, gonna do no reception. I'm gonna wait right here until your guy comes. Okay. Thank you. I've never done anything like that. Huh. Could have fooled me. Yeah? So if it isn't obvious, this episode is going on a little bit longer than I six than I hoped or expected or predicted. He was just reminiscing over memories of the past. All right, well. That'll be it for this episode, guys. Tucker. Well, I hope. Hot Springs Camp, you there? I guess we're gonna need more info on that survivor Larson spotted in Marion Forks. Deacon, I already told you everything I know. Young, a woman. Wait, he mentioned hungry jeans. That old pancake house by the East Bridge. Lumberjack, big stack of pancakes. Yeah, I know. Okay, I'll start there. You do that. And remember, bring her to me. A group of drifters came through the other day, traded us a few guns. Maybe something you could use. I'll keep that in mind. Deacon out. I guess I'll come back here and finish burning this infestation zone later. As I was saying, this going this, uh, this seems to be a good spot to end off this episode. If you did enjoy it, go ahead and leave a like and comment down below. If you didn't, go ahead and tell me what you didn't like. Um, if you are new to the channel, go ahead and consider subscribing. It's up to you, you don't have to. But the goal is 10,000 subscribers by the end of the year. If not that, at least 5,000. I hope you guys have an amazing morning, day, or night whenever you're watching this. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.